This is the takihi, popor and taro layered together with coconut cream, fresh from the coconut, squeezed down into it. Taro sliced with a peeler and papaya all sliced up and layered together onto this banana leaf. Put this on top of the foil and we're going to wrap it up and we're not going to put it in the traditional umu. We're just going to put it in the gas stove today. I want to see the final outcome when it comes out. Coconut has been scraped and squeezed. Okay, this is the final result of our takihi that you see earlier on. Here it is all cooked and now ready to eat. Yes, the fish. My Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What are you having for me? Huh? Are you just having pasta? Um, okay. and there's the parrotfish and dry baked. So you can have it with this coconut cream here in the bottle. But this is what I'm having. Kamakama kama, sea crabs with taro. A bit of taro. And these kamakamas here, they're raw. Take off the leg. So this is the meat inside the leg. Mm. So here's the kamakama meat right here. Coming out of the leg shell. Don't stand on it. Okay, so you just break it up and break them down. And it just suck up the meat and it just pops out. And this is, this hasn't been cooked yet. So these kamakamas here, still fresh, huh? Okay, let's break it and the meat comes out. Now we'll go to the back of it. This is where a lot of the meat's at. Remember, this is still all raw. Mm, see all the fat inside? I can I can be here. I'll save that one for our last. I'll eat this part first. No, no, no. Thank you. Mm. And all the meat's just coming out when I suck on the, the shell. I will suck that meat out. Mm. This is pure crab meat, nothing else added to it.
Fully organic from the ocean. Ooh. Get that part out. See, much easier to do it with the fork like that. There is a certain part inside that will take it to pull away. The part there. And this. There is a hard part in here that you discard. See, and that's the bit that you throw away. That's a bit bitter, the taste. But some people eat it if they, if they wish. But, nah. Yeah, and all this white stuff there. Put it together. Let's have a bit on my taro. Okay. Here's all of it on my taro. I wish I could some lime, chuck yeah. lime on it, and it's the best. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Here it is. What ain't you? Okay, we're just finishing off the two heads there. Didn't have any lime, so the next best thing, lemon juice. Just gonna let a little, little drop on it. Do something different now, a little bit of a coconut cream. Uh -huh. Check that out. Okay, so I've already removed the bitter bits that's inside the head gear. Yeah? Uh, Come. Yeah. Mmm. Second and last one. Yeah, second and final. Here we go. That is just delicious. Mm. Perfect heat. Let's just pour a little bit of coconut cream on it, the spring onions, and that's pure coconut cream. It hasn't been mixed with water or anything. It's a perfect way to cook also a parrotfish if you're not going to smoke it. Put the scales on, bake it dry, and then eat it with coconut cream like this. Too good. Coconut cream and fish. Polynesian diet from over how many years ago? Perfect. Thank you for joining me on this lunch today that I'm having, our Sunday lunch, and see you again on the next video. Peace.